make them bounce. I'm meteorologist Chad Myers, and this tropical update is for October the 12th. We have another hurricane in the Atlantic Ocean, Hurricane Ophelia, but it is not going to approach the Caribbean. It's not going to approach America. It is going to make a run at Ireland. Yes, the other side of the Atlantic Ocean. Make big waves for Portugal and for Spain, and then for France as well, and then try to drive itself into the British Isles. Now, by that time, it's going to be a cold core storm, which doesn't have an eye, true, but it still will have hurricane force winds. And the farther you go north, the more Coriolis force you put into the storm as well. So that will keep the spin going, even though it's getting into colder water. We started with Arlene early, early in the season. And then we moved on and we had some more tropical storms, but then Gert became our first hurricane. And every single storm since then has been a hurricane at some point in its life cycle, 10 in a row. That ties a record set back in the 1800s. If we get one more storm that turns into a hurricane, it'll be Philippe, that'll be 11, that'll be a record-breaking storm. Let's hope that doesn't happen. Those are the records we don't want to break. We are finally seeing the end of hurricane season. Truly, it's not to the end of November, but the peak is certainly in our rearview mirror. The waters are getting colder and the chance of big storms going down and down. But there's the next storms from Philippe, Tarina, and Sean. Let's hope we never get there. Have a great weekend. I'm meteorologist Chad Myers.